God's peace be with you. Welcome to our Lenten devotional for Sunday, April 9th. Happy Easter. We've been to the foot of the cross, and today we stand at the entrance of an empty tomb. These Lenten devotionals we've been sharing with you throughout our journey were written and produced by Luther Seminary in Minnesota. And today's is based on the Gospel of John, chapter 20, verses 1 to 18. And because it is so long, I will leave it to you to read it on your own. Alleluia! Christ is risen. He is risen indeed. In Genesis 2, Adam was placed in a garden and given the vocation to be a gardener, to serve and protect the garden. We know that how that went. In John 20, M Mary Magdalene meets the resurrected Christ in a garden, where she supposes that Jesus is the gardener, which of course he is. The resurrected Christ is new of is the new Adam, says Paul, the gardener that Adam was intended to be, but wasn't. One who would serve and protect the creation from the very evil. It was not until Jesus spoke Mary's name, Mary, that she recognized him. By speaking her name, he restored the relationship she had with him. She then went and uttered the gospel for the first time. I have seen the Lord, she says. Because Mary heard, because she saw, and because she uttered those words, blessed are all who have abundant life in Christ. Alleluia. Let us pray. Risen Lord, tend and keep, serve and protect your creation. May the light and joy of Easter abide with us all year, and may the hope of the resurrection spring eternal. Amen. Thank you for joining me for today's devotional, and thank you for joining me throughout the Lenten journey. Our devotion, regular weekday devotionals return tomorrow, and I hope you join me then. But until next time, whenever that may be, I pray that you remain safe and healthy, and that wherever you go, whatever you do, you share the good news that God has, Jesus has risen, and his love is eternal. God bless.